Anyway, as I was saying, the end of the last episode where I was ranting my ass off about Call of Duty and how much it sucks and how much all the players suck. Um, holy shit, that vacuum cleaner is loud. Um, like, Domination. When you're playing Domination and you have A and B, don't push up on C. Keep them spawn trapped at C. It's not rocket science. If they have C, they will spawn at C. If you push up and take C, they will spawn behind you at A. Cap A. Now they'll still have C because you suck too much to actually cap C. And and now you're screwed. Now you're stuck with just B. And now you're getting spawn killed. It. I don't understand. People are just retarded and I don't get it. It's like fucking common sense. It's so unbelievably easy to be good at Call of Duty. I've said that many times, but I absolutely 100% mean it. It is so, so easy. How can you suck at Call of Duty? It is mind-blowing. Absolutely mind-blowing. And, oh my god, it's just obnoxious. <laughs> and then this. Alright, here's a pro tip. Absolutely pro tip. 100% pro tip. If you have the care package decoy don't throw it across the map at the enemy team if you actually have a care package you wouldn't throw it across the map at the enemy team it's going to be so obvious when it's like enemy care package and it's being dropped next to you no no one in their right mind would take that and now if you're like in the back of your map at your spawn and you call your care package that's a bit more believable you know because then it's like Oh, look, they called a care package back here, and we just came in over in their spawn. Let's take this care package. Not, look, they threw a care package to us. How grateful of them. Or how gracious of them. No, no, no. That's, ugh. What else do I want to rant about? Because everything basically pisses me off. I don't understand. I just don't understand. How can, how can people be so fucking stupid? I mean, I know pretty much everyone is stupid. Like, that that's just a given. You you have to prove that you're not stupid to me. Hang on, I gotta do some math here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eleven, five. Nice, so I can go like one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then one, two, three. Shit! Damn it, is there no way that's gonna be even? I mean, if I do three pillars, say I do two there, two there, two there, two, yeah. There's no way that's gonna be even, so that's gonna have to stay like that. Okay. Also, hill streaks. Why don't you just run a three, four, five, or like four, five, six if you're doing support? Do you have any idea how awesome, how useful it is to cycle through your kill streaks really quick? To constantly have a UAV in the air, even though everyone and their dog uses assassin. To constantly have a UAV though, to have a care package come in and have that care package end up being something that's really useful. Because I've you know, I've gotten AC-130s and Reapers and stuff in the care package. It's like, that's fine enough. And then Predator Missile is a guaranteed couple of kills. You don't need any more than that. You shouldn't need any more than that. If you're relying on these, like, it's absolutely not impressive to me if you have a high KD and you run the high kill streaks. That is not impressive. You camp and play like a bitch for your first nine kills. There you go. All your kill streaks will get you your other kills. And there you go. You're, you're set for life. You don't actually have to do anything, and that's that's absolutely retarded. I don't. Oh my god, people just learn to play the fucking game. Don't play like a bitch. You know, I I don't know. <laughs> I I don't even want to keep ranting about this. I can't think of anything else to rant about on it right now. I just, I don't know, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> I 
I pretty much, I hate the game and everyone that plays it, but I will still sit there and I will play this game like all night. And I don't know why. Why do I put myself through that? Do I want to talk about? Let me see. Let me think about it. Oh, yeah. Getting a gold gun, for one, is not impressive or challenging. But two, I don't understand what happened. Like, how come Call of Duty 4, they got these gold guns? And it's like, if someone's got a gold gun, it's like, damn, they really took their time and they, they got this shit. It's like, that's the thing. It's Call of Duty 4 forced you to be good at the game in order to be successful it was like you want gold guns you have to be able to get headshots with each weapon and you have to get 150 headshots with each weapon that got me it made me good with every single gun in that game i can pick up any gun and do really good with it because i got i got every golden gun in the game in cod 4 it was like oh that's cool it forced me to do that and so i'm a better player because of it and then Modern Warfare 2 comes along and there's no golden guns. It's like, well, what the hell? I didn't see anything wrong with them. I don't know why they took them out, but whatever. I'm in, you know, I don't know their reasoning. I'm in no position to judge. And then Black Ops, you just have to prestige a bunch of times. So you just basically have to grind since what prestige you are means absolutely shit. Like, I only prestiged in Modern Warfare 2 because... I wanted, well, first off, I wanted the title five-sided Vistagon, and I wanted a few more class slots. And then in Black Ops, I was only prestiging because I wanted my gold AK back from COD 4. Modern Warfare 3, I'm not prestiging at all. I have zero reason to. I can get the gold guns without leveling up, and I have prestige tokens from the other games, so I was able to get three custom class slots... And there you go. I'm set. I have no reason to prestige. Why should I bother with that shit? I don't need the extra challenges. I don't need any extra shit. And then Call of Duty 4, I prestiged because the game was fun. It was fun to keep leveling up. It was fun to earn everything. Now everything is just a grind and it's not fun to do at all. Because everyone plays like a bitch and it just feels like a job. Like to get a gold gun, that gap between 30 and 31 is unbelievable to get your gold gun. It's like, why? We're, there's no challenge in this. I just need to use the gun every game for the next, like, week. It's like, yeah, you know, I... What I've been doing lately, like, I got the old K... Re, or old K. The gold AK relatively quickly. Um, because I just... I... Yeah, let me try and format a sentence here. <laughs> I used the two attachments thing and I put the attach different attachments on so I would keep getting the attachment challenges and then I had it by like I think like 758 kills or something I had my gold AK it's like that wasn't challenging I just used the gun every game I didn't have to carefully get headshots you know to you know, I, did, I didn't have to do anything. I didn't have to do any work. I just had to grind, and it's not fun or worth it. So by the time I get a golden gun, I'm sick of using that gun, and I don't want to use it anymore. So it's like, like I got, I got the, uh, um, I got the gold Type 95 first, because me and one of my friends were, were using the Type 95, like, before it was flavor of the month, I guess you could say. It was like, dude, how was no one using the Type 95? Like, we never came across people using it. It was like, this gun is so OP and broken, it's not even fair. And then, I, so I got it gold relatively quickly, and then I'm like, well, that was annoying, and I don't want to use the gun anymore. So it's like, oh, oh now I'm never using that gun ever again. 
<laughs> and so I don't. I don't use the Type 95 like ever because I was so sick of using it. I don't want to use it anymore. And now the same goes, I'm doing the MP5 right now. Because I don't know what it is, but I love the MP5. And so it's like I'm using the MP5 and, uh... Not torches. I'll be using it and then... Sorry, I'm totally spacing out. But as soon as I'm done with getting the MP5 gold, I'm going to be sick of it. And I'm going to want to move on to something else because it's just... It's not fun to keep using the same gun over and over again, but it's like I want to get it gold. That's why those challenges are there. That's why it's there is for me to do it. So it's like once I get it gold, then I'm just going to move on. I'm not going to want to use the gun ever again, which is pointless. Whereas getting like the gold AK, it was like, what an accomplishment. I got to show this off now. So it was like I'd run around with a gold AK with no attachments, of course, because you got to use a gold gun, no attachments, like a boss. But... I don't know, I just... I'm done complaining. I don't know why I bother to continue to play when I hate everything about the game. But I still continue to play, so... In the words of the great Jay-Z, it is what it is. I'm gonna keep playing the game, I'm gonna keep doing good, and everyone else is gonna keep being a little bitch and not play the game. So I'll just be complaining the whole time. Alright, home. No, oh, no, that can stay there. Oh, shit. That's like, if you're wondering, the reason I'm going for the gold guns is just because it gives me a reason to, like, play. Otherwise, if I didn't try and get the gold guns, I'd be like, all right, so why am I playing again? I really don't need to be playing, so I don't. I'm doing it just because it gives me something to do. And that's, like, not a very good reason to be playing a game. you people want from me. <laughs> awesome game Call of Duty 4 uh, it's like really good and gonna win game of the year because it deserves it and then we're gonna ruin it <laughs> is that is that uh, their business model over at uh, place Infinity Ward Activision is that their their motto we like to crush the hopes and dreams of our fans <laughs>
I'm like out of it. I'm out of things to say. I, I got nothing. I don't know what you want from me. I'm gonna go get some sand. I can get some glass. See, like Minecraft, there's, there's nothing to complain about. Any, like, fun or not fun that you're having is all uh, on your own. Because you only have as much fun with Minecraft as you put into it. Holy shit. Hey. Why does it keep lagging like that? I'm like all exhausted now from ranting and I'm super tired from programming all morning. Sorry, lone tree that I wanted to keep up. <sighs> what else to talk about? Kind of thing. Just like right now, I'm playing Skyrim, Minecraft, League of Legends, and Call of Duty. That's that's my game. That's my games that I play right now. Looks pretty cool. So I had some supports that'll look nice once I get it all finished. And I'll have like more layers and it'll be a nice place. You know what? I'll make a quick little, quick little light starting to die in my room. Uh, did I not pick it up? Why is it dropping in frames like that? Oh to hell. Seriously. Uh, I'm so exhausted from ranting. <laughs> Everyone else sucks at the game and I don't understand why. And I don't understand how people can think they're good when they do some of the things that they do. Like, yeah, I'm really good at Call of Duty. I quick scope and use the UMP. <laughs> wow. I bow to you, sir. You clearly are a superior player in every aspect. I have no right to even be in the same room as you. It's like, yeah, you know, I've quick scoped. I've done the fancy 360 shots. They're not fun. <laughs> What's the joy in, like, super easy mode? Game does it for you. Sorry, I'm ranting about the game again. I'll stop. I got nothing more to say. Oh my god, stop dropping in frames! Uh. Oh, that's gonna be enough glass. Let's see. Yeah, on top of the mountains, I'm gonna have a tree farm. Well, it was nice to sit down and actually get some work done on my single player world. I mean, well, then I didn't get a lot done. In fact, I might just keep playing on it without recording because I, I don't want to talk anymore. <laughs> but I don't want to not play Minecraft on my single player world. I mean, you're really not going to be missing out on much. It's going to be a lot of building and like boring shit. And since I've got nothing to rant or talk about, it's going to be pretty horrible to watch. I want to make a bed. I don't know if I have my bed there. That'll be the last thing I do on this episode.
I am so exhausted from just being angry about Call of Duty being the worst game in the world. Like, that's remarkable that a game can do that. I just want to put torches down. Uh, oh. Alright, so I'll have a bed. That'll be good. Alright. Should just take a nap after all that. <laughs> Where the hell am I going? I mean, well, thanks for <laughs> watching me rant about worst game on the planet. Uh, and then, to make everything worse, it won Best Shooter of the Year from fucking Spike TV's Game Awards. It's like... It's not a good game. It really isn't. Is it fun? Well, yeah, sometimes it's pretty fun. It's like, oh, that was so much fun, that was cool. I like playing this game. But more times than not... It's terrible. And it's just like, it's not good. It is the most mundane or whatever. Alright, I'm done reading. <laughs> Thanks for watching.